I'm gonna show you how you can gear your alts really, really quickly. I'm actually sitting at the 601 eye level right now. And there is a few ways that you can gear yourself really easily. So one is having these uh, bloody tokens. They are not bad to say the least. Um, and you're able to use them to buy gear. Um, I actually bought the missing wrist that I was missing and it pushed me over to 601. I am going to buy either legs or a belt so that I'm able to get the next piece and push my eye level a little bit higher. But I wanna show you some other cool things. Inside Delves, there are these uh, Warbound pieces. And if we look right here, you can see Warbound until equipped Veteran 584. And this one, Warbound until equipped 584. Both of these are Veteran pieces that I got from a Bounty, uh, a Bountiful Bounty, Bountiful Delve at a tier eight. And so I can send these to my alts. I can farm these uh, bloody tokens and you get that from turning war mode on. So if you push, what is it? B, push your skill tree and it is war mode enabled. Uh, from there, you can also get honor. Uh, if we go over here, you can see there is some honor gear if you don't have your 558 or conquest gear, which will give you some nice loots. I will be replacing some of my gear uh, for some champion. So I do have some conquest. I will probably get either leggings um, to fix my final set um, in champion gear, just so that I do not have to do any more heroics or mythics up until I think six. So I can kind of skip ahead when season one starts. And to get these bloody tokens, it's really, really easy. So you'll see the, I just passed it, but uh, this thing right here, it is an airship with a box of conquest, uh, a box of blood tokens and all sorts of patterns. I've got these patterns right here this uh, inscription pattern, and this flask pattern, which I'll probably use, sells for 15,000. Um, so I got a few, th and this one over here actually, uh, fractured locket. So all sorts of things for jewel crafting that sells for 21,000. So that's like 30,000 right there. And we win this every single time. So I just click on this, I open. And boom. And as you can see, you just got 10 sparks of winner, uh, bloody tokens, 150 honor, uh, 60 conquest. And I just earned a uh, title, earn 1000 honor in the aisles in war mode. So not too bad. I mean, I, I don't, I'm capped on my currency for uh, bloody tokens, but I can use, I, I'm still trying to gain my uh, conquest for new leggings. I just upgraded my uh, belt to that 593. I'll go put some of my Valor tokens in there. And then I will be upgrading it with conquest for my legs until I get something better. So that's how you can uh, gear an alt really, really quickly using, I mean, I mean that took what, five minutes? And you do that every couple times you can get uh, quite the gear. I've replaced um, with bloody tokens, I've replaced with 593, 5, uh, 603 veteran gear. Uh, and I can just go over here now and upgrade this. We just put this a bad boy in here. We have some harbingers. carved harbingers and there we are so now we're at 600 with this 601 eye level with a pvp level of 606 um and we're almost capped with all of our, so all of our veteran gear is capped the only thing we need to replace is our uh pants and then these two rings are both um I think adventure, yeah. So adventure, all my rest of my gear is veteran, 
and then champion. So, and as I progress, my great quests will go. I have a bunch of these keys, which you guys will definitely want to tune in because I have a great strategy on getting some keys at least and how you do that. Uh, pretty cool trick we found out today. And then uh, obviously your, um, your renown. So at 19, I do get a conquest or a champion's trinket. Um, which I think I already have, actually. I, have, I should have two champion trinkets. Yeah, two champion trinkets already, which I don't really need, but maybe maybe I can use it. And then I have a... What do we have? We also have the Assembly of the Deep. At 16, I get boots. Which, again, I already have Conquest. But for those that have alts, you know, it's it's great to, to level them. And then we have... I think we have wrists also coming up. Uh, is it here? Here? One of these. I want to say it's like right here. So yeah, here's a uh, champion belt and that's at uh, 19. So that would replace my current belt, which is pretty sweet. I just got a lot of days before I can cap that out. And then finally we have hollow fall and I believe I get it at 18. Yeah, so in two more I do get some wrists that are 597 to upgrade my uh, PVP wrist. So, um, and these were veteran gear also. So all of these are easy ways you can upgrade your alts. Like I said, the bloody tokens are probably the easiest. And then finally, the very easiest is just buying it off the auction house. Um, I can buy a 616 piece for 600,000. Uh, a waste, which would be a uh, craft, it's not even crafted, it's a BOE and it's not upgradable. So it looks like these are non upgradable, but a million uh, gold for 616, 616. So, I mean, and there's a lot of them. People are farming them up, making some great money. So definitely check those out. Yeah, I'm going to be going over how we're farming keys. So definitely be on the lookout for that. Uh, but that's how you can gear your alt very, very easily. Um, definitely tune in because we will be uh, showing you how we can farm some relic keys. Uh, I've used, f I want to say six, and I still have 12 more. So I will be farming them over the next few days. Maybe I'll even do uh, a, uh, a stream if you guys want me to with some guildies. So that's it, guys. Remember to like and subscribe. We will be doing probably a tier 11 tonight or tomorrow uh, to show you guys that. But that's about it. Remember to like and subscribe. I said that like four times, so do it. Peace.